Okay, so I've also been using that with this T3 brush. Um, this is actually a new thing for me. Like, I've never been the type to say, I, I, I'll say splurge, even though I know there are brushes that could be way more expensive than this. But, like, this is definitely a little bit of a splurge brush for me. Um, and I really, really love it. I actually didn't even know the importance of, like, using good heat like uh styling tools like heated styling tools and brushes on your hair until I got my hair done a couple of months ago and I was talking to my hairdresser and he was saying like those are actually the most important things like aside from product your brush and your styling tools are like the most important thing that will damage your hair so I think spending a little bit more on a really really great product is so worth it especially if you're like me and you're coloring your hair like Coloring your hair is so expensive. So you want to like preserve it as long as you can because splurging on like a little brush like this is definitely much more financially responsible than like not doing it and having to get your hair done more often because that can get like crazy expensive. Um, so I really love this brush. Again, it's super lightweight. I really like the colors that they use too. I know that's like not that important, but it's just nice that all of their products are like the same um, color. Sorry, I actually have some hair in this brush. That's gross. Um, I just like that they're these colors and they all match and they look nice, like in a nice way that bathroom. But it's basically just your standard like blow dry brush. Like I said, I really like to take my front pieces and kind of like blow them up with a rolled or a, a round brush. Um, so this is a great one. It's not damaging on your hair. I really like it. Super lightweight. I've just really been liking the way that it makes my hair look. I think it's a good, um, I don't, I'm not going to call it barrel because it's not like a curling iron, but I think the like circumference is a good size to give you like volume, but also a little bit of flippiness at your ends. Um, I've been really into hot rollers in my hair lately. So I really like like flippiness at the bottoms and I think that's a great brush for that. Um, I do kind of have a million products to talk about, so I'm going to run through them fairly quickly. But if you have any more questions about either of those, definitely let me know. Um, so now I'm going to jump into just kind of refreshing my curl.